Welcome to your daily love reading. I hope everyone is good. Let's see what's going on in love at this time. Hope everyone is super great. What are the vibes in love? What's going on? So we're going to take a look at how your person is feeling. And how you're feeling, of course, here. All right? Someone here is having some sort of regrets here. Now, the regrets is not coming from... How do I say this? Are we still stalking? Someone here is still stalking. We're going to put this to the side, but there's regrets coming in in a sense of like, I'm not, I'm not really regretting what I did. I'm regretting the outcome of what I did or what I'm doing, if that makes sense, right? It's like the consequences of what I did is now, you know, shining some light into my life here. So someone here is just like, wow, you know, I had no problem ignoring. I had no problem being aloof. I had no problem, you know, being arrogant because that's what we have here, right? I had no problem doing that in the moment, although I know I probably should have never did it. But now I'm looking at the consequences and the consequences could be potentially I'm alone, Right. I don't have anyone to talk to. I don't really have someone that genuinely care like you did, like you do. Things like that. You know, like sometimes it sinks in. And if this is for a cross watcher and maybe, you know, you may be feeling like this. I understand. I get it. But someone here is saying, did that really get me far? Right. This arrogant energy states. <laughs> If I don't get it from you, I'll get it from someone else. Now, what could that be? What was it that this person wasn't getting from you? That they felt confident enough to go get somewhere else? Could be emotions, could be other things, right? Um, could be intimacy, could be money, could be anything. Could be validation, could be something, all right? Whatever it is here, <clears throat> someone here didn't get it. And now they're thinking, thinking into their white cloth. Like, is this something that really is this really working for me? All right. Could be also like possibly the, the two of you used to talk a lot at night or the two of you used to spend a lot of time together. And now that's again at a halt or it's just not happening. You guys like my nail color? You know, I always have red. Put pink on. Anywho, we have a stalking energy here. Now, of course, this comes off as if like it's a mutual energy, the stalking energy. So someone here is like, watching you and i feel like this also came out in the last collective reading i've done so someone here could be again trying to keep tabs waiting for someone's next move wondering what someone here is learning have you learned anything are you going to fall for whatever trap i put out someone here is just very curious right now this curiosity you may or may not know this person stalking you or it could be you all right no judgment here of course but someone here is watching and wanting a little bit more information if this is you I'm happy that you're here because here is a stalking channel and we are going to stalk, okay? So let's see how my viewers are feeling. Let's see how my viewers are feeling about everything that may be going on currently. Of course, hit the like button and subscribe. Okay, if you're interested in a personal reading as well, everything is below. What's going on? What's the vibe with my beautiful collective here? Pushing buttons and love triangle some of you are at a point where you're asking yourself if you should just move on oh i feel like for some of you too like someone here they made you feel like they could do better or this person possibly said something to you that i feel like you're still possibly disappointed at or did something there's something here that happened and you're saying to yourself well yes i was angry i was upset about that I didn't like that. And I feel like for some of you, you're possibly trying to keep your cool or you're trying to not say anything or you're trying to not, again, fall into this person's trap. But this person may be giving you some sort of indication that they have you in a love triangle or this person wants you to think that they have you in a love triangle. There's something about someone questioning, is there other people? Did you have me in a love triangle? Was this something where it wasn't just you and I and it was more people? Like, what's going on? And this could be, again, what you're possibly wanting to know, right? Why are you pushing my buttons? 
Some of you don't really know how much this person missed you. It's like a hidden energy. All right. Let's get some more, please, for the mutual. Let's get more for the mutual energy, please. The mutual vibe here. The mutual energy. What is going on? Unsent messages. Someone here is asking themselves, like, would would they forgive me for what I've done or for how I did it? Okay. Someone here is at times they come off extremely immature. Okay. From what I'm feeling like, unfortunately, I have to say that. But someone here is coming off very immature. There are some messages here that want to be sent. I'm not sure if this is from you or your person, but someone here is saying to themselves, like, how can I talk about this? How could I speak to this person? So someone here actually wants to speak. All right. They want to communicate. They don't want this to linger for another couple of days or a couple of months. Like, let's just say something. I'm also getting this vibe where it's like there's so many times where I was this close to possibly saying something or doing something here. OK, maybe for some of you, you're seeing that this is someone here that's posting pictures with different people or you're just intuitively picking up that there may be a third party or you're picking up like this person, you know, really never cared the way that, you know, I thought that they should care. OK, anything else here about their person here? Let's get this person's vibe. Anything else that my viewers need to know, need to feel? Yeah, someone here, it's like they miss you. You gave this person a lot of great advice. You gave this person a lot of like, like a lot of different, different perspectives about life here. So this person thinks about that a lot. Could be a fire sign you're connecting with, or again, you lit. Yeah, they're thinking about you a lot. Someone here is deeply thinking about you. Like they think about you, but they think about like the things that you've helped them notice, the things that you've helped them recognize in life here. And again, this is why we have these this late night energy here. I wouldn't be surprised if this person's also waking up and dreaming about you or waking up and debating whether they should say something to you or not. But this is, again, like silent energies. It doesn't come off as if it's like very clear at all in terms of them thinking about you. Yeah, especially with this ego energy here. It's not it doesn't seem like it's something that you would notice or you would see here again, because this person could be very cold or this person's not someone that's very emotionally expressive at times. All right. Especially because of like their past relationships or things of that nature. And I feel like with you, you're again, possibly having to be cold as well, but it's like, that's not even my MO. It's not my MO, right? Let's get a little bit more from my viewers here. What's their vibe? What's their vibe today? We have karmic partner and we have unstable. Some of you, you starting to notice like this person may be a little unstable or you're feeling like most of the things that this person made you feel like you're starting to lose like faith, I feel like, in this connection. But at the same time, you still want to be close to them. That's interesting. That is an interesting message. So it's like maybe possibly you're questioning, like, will this person ever become stable enough for us to be close once again here? For some of you, there's I don't know why, but there's an energy of you still being a bit disappointed in this person. And maybe this person possibly is in a, you know, this place of like a very apologetic vibe. Clarify this unstable and so close. Like, I feel like someone's wondering, like, could we be close again? But you have to be stable. So you want someone here to show you some sort of stability. Why is unstable here? Maybe friends and family are telling you, like, this is not a stable vibe here. And a part of you is starting to believe it, but a part of you still miss this person as well. Yeah, this person could be someone that's like in and out. Very in and out at times with the Knight of Wands here. They're unstable or their, their life is very unstable or the way that they move. Could, again, immature at times. But there's something that's very unstable with this person's words, with this person's actions. But again, I miss you, right? We have this I miss you here. We have the tower. Again, you're you're feeling like if I give this a chance, how will this go? Right? Page of Pentacles here. Page of Pentacles, of course, talks about communication. It talks about 
a new beginning, a new offer, a fresh start. So if this message comes in or if this opportunity comes in, are you willing to actually give this another chance? Could you trust this person again? Could you trust this person to be true? Could you trust this person to put their fears aside as well? Okay. You feel like you're connecting with a runner here, someone here that decides to hold back whenever things get too intense. In the extended, we are going to take a look and see exactly what this person's true intentions are here, especially with everything that's going on with this person, with these late night energies. We're going to take a look at they, their movement, their actions, their intentions, how they feel about you. And again, you know, what the outcome of this. And I'll also take a look at some time frames for you. All right. We have the time frame deck here. So we'll see what spirit brings in when it comes to time frame and see what you're working with. All right. If you're interested, I'll see you up next. The link is below. Have a beautiful one. Talk to you soon. Just things, honestly. And I could really feel that deeply, actually, just spiritually. I could feel that this is someone here that's in a place of saying, I really, I'm really sorry that I even did that to you. Okay, we're going to take a look uh, deeper here to see how this person plans on taking some sort of action here. Okay, let's look a little bit more here, see what else spirit wants to say when it comes to this connection. Is there anything else that my viewers need to know?